Hey guys, your inner chakras, welcome back to the channel, guys. If you are new, you are welcome, guys. We're gonna do some digging. Let's just do some digging. I'm starting with 1 800 to roll and see where that takes us, and then we'll do something else. Okay. What is most important for the collective in regards to their situation? What needs to be highlighted, right? In this situation. Oh. Oh. So the cards are talking directly to you. It says, do you want or need the masculine? There's a difference. Mm. Do you want or need the masculine? There's a difference. Okay. 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 <laughs> it says pull another card. Look, guys, it says pull another card. Okay. Pull another card, shall we? Holy Spirit, what? Give me the card that I should pull for the collective. It says believe in yourself more than you more than you believe in anyone else. So it that takes us back to the first card. So it's like, do you need this masculine or do you want this masculine? There's a difference, right? A need is something like, oh, I can't be without this person. I'm not going to make it if I don't have this person, blah, 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 blah. And then a want is kind of like, you have the candy store. And you want the green apple. <laughs> you know? Like, it's a want. It's an addition to you. It's not a need. Um, but they're telling you to believe in yourself more than you believe in this person. All right, guys. So I'm going to crack this case open. Let's crack it open with some, some um, what is this, the looking glass. Let's crack it open, shall we? Okay. Love, expressing love, showing love, thinking about you, sending you something. It's in the cards. Somebody, maybe somebody wants to come in and take a chance with you. They're being strategic, not showing their hand. Holy Spirit. This person here is recovering from heartbreak. So your divine masculine, whoever this person is, they're recovering from heartbreak. They're releasing themselves from a toxic relationship. So maybe they will in turn come and share love with you. But they're still healing. So while they're healing, it's like you could be waiting for this masculine or wanting this masculine to appear. But in the meantime, between time, spirit is telling you to just believe in yourself, right? Like, it's nice that if, if you can get this person, but it's okay if you don't. Holy oh, Spirit, we want you to believe in yourself. I'm going to take that in reverse. That person could be ending a marriage, right? I never take these in reverse, but I'm going to start. So they could be ending a marriage, coming out of something. Yeah, that's the main male. This could be the person that you're thinking about. They could be actively ending a marriage. But even if you know this, sometimes... They could have told you, I'm going to be with you after my divorce. So spirit is telling you, don't put all your apples in that basket. Like, believe in yourself more than you believe in this connection. I mean, it's great if it comes, but keep some eggs out that basket. Because they're ending a marriage, and I just don't see people ending a marriage getting right back into something immediately. Maybe a year or so will pass, and then they'll get into something, but not immediately. Yeah, official person. They're, they're getting divorced here. Oh. Oh, yeah, high honors is in, in reverse. So this main male here, whoever's on your mind, guys, they're probably in the middle of a divorce or just actively gotten a divorce. All right, let's dive in. But just believe in yourself. It's not saying that this can't happen. It could happen, you know, but we're definitely going here. Holy Spirit, what messages do you have for the collective? Yeah. This is 
definitely someone from your past. They could be thinking about you as well. They're just not showing their hands. Yeah, they're thinking about the past uh, because they ended this connection that they were in. Yeah, they ended something and now they're thinking about the past. They could be thinking about um, this new love offer. Yeah, they're gambling with love. They're just not showing their hands. So this person's divorced. They're thinking about you. Yeah, they just came out of something. Ten of Cups in reverse. Mm -hmm. They're being strategic. They're not showing their hands, guys. Yeah, they've been through a toddler. Maybe you've been through a toddler with this person. You probably had something. But whatever this person's been through, it's like it's not... It's not stopping them from sleeping. It's not stopping them from going to work. It's not, it's like they're not losing any sleep. They do want to come and talk to you guys. They want to reveal some truth. They want to tell you some things. They want to reveal some truth. They see you as an empress. Yep, they see you as the empress. They want to come and tell you some truth. They probably want to come and tell you that they were married. They're probably going to tell you that they got a divorce. Mm -hmm. Yep, they see you as the divine feminine. I sent it, and they said, I want you to be mine. Yeah, they see you as their divine feminine. Just a matter of time, guys. A matter of time. And they're wondering, will my children like me? Wow. Wow, that's deep. This person is coming back. They want to know if their children will like you. I think that's their only worry. That's their only worry. Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit, Romance Angels, what is this person bringing to the collective? Like, what are they bringing to you? Right? You're going to be getting to know each other, guys. You're going to be getting to know each other. This is calling in your soulmate. Your prayers, affirmations, everything helps. So something happened in their life, and this person's coming. Release your ex. So you may have someone in your energy. And on the bottom, this is your soulmate. So you're going to have to release an ex because your soulmate is coming. Yep, birds. That's what they said. Their biggest worry is, will my children like you? They're really not worried about anything else. Everything else will fall into place. All right, guys. That's quite interesting. Wait a minute. Hold up. Hold up. I love readings like this. When it's like this, I always get an additional angels, a message from the angels if I can remember to do it. So this is a good one. Holy Spirit. And it's pretty straightforward. I love pretty straightforward messages. Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit. You're going to have to choose a new direction. I think you're going to have to release that X. They could be choosing a new direction, guys. Romance, yep. This is bringing in romance, guys. Oh, let's take it. It says a year from now, a year from now. Maybe a year from now you'll be marrying this person, right? That doesn't mean that it has to be a year from now before this the energy starts. Like the energy can start a month from now. And what I mean mean by that is the conversations. Y'all start talking on the phone. Y'all start hanging out before you know it. It's summer. Then it's fall then we're here again like it happens really fast a year from now isn't long like it really isn't you blink you can take a good ass snap and you wake up and it'll be march again in 2024 you know what i mean so spirit said it could be a year from now that doesn't mean you will not be talking to this person a year from now it can start tomorrow for some of you it can start the next day it can start next week um but their only message is um they're just worried about if their children will like you or not and this is a matter of time guys 
Look up Kendrick. Is it Kendrick? No, it's um. Oh God, it starts with a K. Matter of Kim, K E M. Matter of time. Look it up, guys. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe.